a moment of overwhelming. These are words. So let me read from that way of recognition. By that inspiration and inspiration, then, oh no, we are not overwhelmed while clouds recollect to print the shape of our ribs to the sky. We observe as if a self-portrait or a map of time or that wondrous inspiration of the inspiration or like a baby who views a self-image in the mirror, circulating wind through to reshape our apparatus with no loss while housing both the teacher and the student within simultaneously in the void which is one and the so-called model learns thus with no loss the secret signs of reading skies in a space of no time where all time becomes accessible is accessible to the dancer model thus while divinities of senses accumulated from various refracted planes of existences draw by temporarily aligning along the curve that activates this curve is assumed to be universal by the confidence of a radiance rising from grounds and by our surrendering to it as lovers would do to each other or a child in the lap of a mother is the same as the absolute silent space made of pure knowledge between the teacher and the student is to implement the view of the both in the model. We look as wondrous as we would see our face in the mirror with the ever fresh joy of the very first time as an epitome of the self, which is an empty sphere as if in the heart, full of this dance, unfixable, unchangeable, ever free. And the model says, I have so much gratitude for my teachers that I can take the shapes that I assume, mostly like the movement of flowers in the wind, is to sing a song of reverence for them. And readily I share the bodies that I synchronously arrange to dissolve with them so that they can teach without words of skies, of waters. Yet I am an assumption of them I prefer, so long I learn, but full of heart, this act of learning, also all gifted to them. I have even renounced that. I have even renounced the renounced, the middle of the middle, irreversibly, is radiance. Speechless I remain. Speechless I remain. It only looks like I stand here, but in truth I stand over pixels of time to renounce. Such is standing interchangeable by any word 
and that it, that I is not who you think. It is that awareness which is poseless. I is the tree, the flower, the girl, the writer, the reader, one, a smile of gratitude to teachers, a homage of equanimity making the divine residence of the I, your heart. And the mother learns. My head made of skies, my roots made of earth, my body is time. My body is space. I is a splash of salty seawater on the face. A sudden recognition and lucid through worlds. All made of the same material. Travel unmoving. Here by being. Same is all or none, a poem unuttered. Uh, that was it, the reading. Not too bad. Thanks. <laughs>